for those of you and for those times when you feel like you just work at getting things right all the time, you work all the time, you never let yourself truly have a break, you keep getting sick, the work doesn't seem to go anywhere. The people that know you don't understand, or you feel like they don't understand, and then you feel the frustration, the pain of being sick on top of it, whatever the case may be. That's where I'm coming to you from today. One of my favorite ASMR Reiki videos is a silver hair ASMR when he did his videos for anger Reiki and he didn't whisper and he had been sick and he struggles with health issues and I just love those videos I just love I could just feel the like his gentle intensity there something like that but um There, you know, there's so many people out there that try to, I try to stay positive, always find solutions for my health issues, just, you know, different things. And then you feel like it's not getting better, they're getting worse. People don't understand. They're not sympathetic. They're just judgmental because I mean they don't understand they don't if they're not you they don't understand maybe your family is also judgmental you're not where you should be whatever so just be a more or I should say less slow less quiet not whispered ASMR video to go along with my Christmas time series right now. You can just enjoy the more, uh, I want to say solid because I can't find the word, hand movements, more aggressive. I guess just kind of slapping that pain, that frustration, that whatever away. Just get out. Just get out. So you know that you can keep going. Keep fighting the good fight in hopes that, you know, one day the fight can turn into <laughs> relaxation. Bless you, if you heard that. But sometimes it's just, it's frustrating. It's frustrating. And then the worst thing yeah. is, bless you again. You have the internet, so you know. You're reading about your problems while you're having them. I do that. I don't know. I've heard other people say they do that too. Like when I'm in excruciating pain. And uh, while I'm in pain and can barely sit up, I'm reading about the pain. Trying to like, you know, get control. Figure it out. Figure out something new. And I tell myself, I'm like, why are you doing this right now? Relax. Relax. Try to go to sleep. Wipe, 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 fluff, fluff, breathe out.
Just let out all that shallow, frustrated breath that you've been holding on to. I was speaking to someone the other day, someone close to me, not my husband, someone else close to me, I won't say who. And they're like, oh, so you're over your sickness, are you? Like, as if to say, you know, are you really over it this time? You know, like, shouldn't be happening to you. Again, shouldn't keep happening. You know, and for some people, being sick frequently is part of their thing that they're dealing with, maybe for a period of time in their life, or maybe forever. And you just gotta embrace, you know, keep trying to figure things out, keep trying to figure out solutions, but embrace that. Things are the way they are for you. If you get intense pain, if you get frequent bad colds, if you get frequent migraines, if you know, just different things. These are things that I deal with, obviously. And just, you know, sometimes it is just the way your body is and you have to just try to be as best you can be and that's good enough it's great so you're here and being here is great whatever state you're in oh yeah so top of being sick I'm starting to feel I don't know a bit better like in a way but not in another way I uh, I'm trying to start my broth series because I think that doing my uh, gaps diet again is gonna really help me I'm gonna do it in the new year earlier than I had anticipated originally if you're interested in the gaps diet look it up <laughs> G-A-P-S diet, but I did it a few years ago and it was life changing, but uh, then I did some, you know, medicine stuff, whatever, and kind of seemed to whack me out again, I don't know, I'm not a doctor, I don't know, but it seemed to whack me out again, so I'm going to do the diet again, and uh, I was just trying to find broth recipes because broth is a big part major component of the diet but I was just trying to find broth recipes like sick like feeling shitty like all morning like it's specifically from uh, Cambodia because I watched this amazing show yesterday I couldn't find them I couldn't find them and I know the point of the show was talking about how this chef is trying to hold on to the traditional Cambodian recipes because they're going away I guess that's true because I couldn't find them and then, I, and then I realized I had a book already on broth lots of broth and I was like oh of course <laughs> of course I have it already so anyway at least I got the information <sighs> okay I'm done This is Cass Contents. Thank you so much, everyone, for coming today. I know sometimes these kind of angry, or more intense ASMR things are just what you need. So hopefully this is finding you, you know, when you need it. And uh, I'll see you for another video in a few days. Thank you so much. I'll see you soon.